art is important for people and Merrion Square is an opportunity for people to buy art from the artist. This is a rare thing and it gives people a story to tell about their paintings. It gives people when they get something that they love and art should always be something you love yourself because that's what art is. It's about touching the emotions. My name is Simon Myler and I'm an artist and I exhibit here every Sunday with my colleagues. This is Dublin's open air art gallery on Merrion Square, the lovely Georgian setting of Merrion Square. We come in here at about 8.30, 9 o'clock. We take our time to set up our work, put on our best display. Um, hail, rain or snow, we're here every Sunday. And it's, a, it's a, just a, a fine spot to, to view paintings. And especially on a, a day like this, it, it's really cool. My name is Jim Mullins and I live out in Newtown on Kennedy in County Wicklow. But I'm originally from East Cork. I joined here about four years ago and it's the best thing I've ever done in my life. Because I found that if I like to talk about my work and what I do and I can meet people from all over the world and talk about my art. When tourists go to a country, they want to see the arts. They want to get an idea, what are the arts? Like they want to listen to music, they want to sort of see go to the opera or whatever, go to a concert, go to a play. And art is just as part of that. And like, where is a tourist going to go to see art of a Sunday? So in a way, we're the forefront uh, of this, they say, visual art in Ireland, because we're here. Hi, I'm uh, Roland Byrne, and myself and my father, Val Byrne, show our artwork here on Merrion Square and we have been doing so since uh, well about the very early 1990s I think it was 1992 that my mum Anne brought my father's first watercolour paintings to Merrion Square well the way that we uh, we get our licenses to operate it's a casual trading license this is actually a copy of my my mother's original license back to 1992 and uh, it's all done through uh, Dublin City Council and uh, it's a casual trading license and everybody is allocated their own spot here every week. So if somebody comes to see your art, they'll find you in the same location the following week. What surprises me about Merrion Square is the amount of people that I meet from Dublin. And they say, I never knew this was on. So what I'm saying to everybody is, is that it's on pretty much every single Sunday and it has been since about 1985 or the mid 80s. Come out and see us. You don't have to buy a piece of art. Just come and see us, come and enjoy the art and you never know what you might find, but you would have a bit of crack along the way. Hi, good morning. Uh, my name is Father Sharon. I've been on Merrion Square since uh, 97. Uh, coming up with my 20th anniversary. Uh, over the last 20 years, uh, we've seen quite a number of changes. When I started here, uh, the square was fairly quiet, but uh, I've noticed in the last year, there's been a big pickup again. Hi, I'm Thelma Mansfield. Um, you probably know me from uh, a, a different life when I worked on television, but in the last 15 years or so, I've been here exhibiting every Sunday on Marion Square. Complete contrast to my previous life on television, but I wouldn't change this for the world. I absolutely love it. I, I look so forward to coming in every Sunday. It's lovely to meet people um, who can sort of comment on your work because as an artist you're, you're working in your studio alone. It's, it's very solitary and this is such a contrast. It's so sociable. It's a truly charming place. I'm so privileged to actually work here. I'm so privileged to show my work, so privileged to, to know the artists that I know and to meet the people who come to visit every Sunday. Gerard Dolan is my name. I was uh, a founder member of the Ad Hoc Committee, which was set up in 1985 with the idea of uh, ex exhibiting for the first time out of doors in Dublin. 
and it was a, an offspring from the People's Art Exhibition which was held annually at that time and a number of artists got the notion they'd like to be more frequently on the street. So since then we've been exhibiting for 30 odd years. It's now the 33rd years in fact. There's a different atmosphere on, on the uh, street uh, as against being in a gallery. In a gallery there's a more um, organised approach about it. Here there's a free and easy way and people just who wouldn't normally be going out of the way to look at art come along and have a look at the paintings. And there's a wonderful range of work here and all of very high quality I would say. So people come along and they get something from looking at it. Yeah. I'm uh, Elizabeth Prendergast. I'm a botanical artist and I'm in Merrion Square 11 and a bit years. It's real. It gives people something to talk about when they when they bring their when they bring their painting home and they hang it in their in their house. It's the narrative of the painting which is very important as well. Not just that they love it to bits themselves, but that they have a very, very important memory for them as part of their work of art. And we'd love to have lots more people joining because it's actually a very happy place to be. You meet lovely people, you get the support of artists, you get the support of all the people who are walking by. And if you've got nice work, they'll tell you. People are only delighted to chat and talk and it's a when you're an artist, you know, you're at home all day on your own. It is lovely to have the social aspect of Merrion Square. It's very nice.